Hey, ladies and gentlemen, Dale Calvert here. Over the next couple of minutes, I just want to explain to you how to identify and look for bait and switch blog posts because they're everywhere. They're all over the Internet. And it's just something that if you're going to be in type, in, involved in any type of business, you need to be aware of that and understand that and to be able to distinguish the difference between a bait and switch blog post and a legit blog post are a credible uh, source of information. It's just important. So long story short, we had one of our team members that was trying to post an ad on a very well-known social media platform, and the ad was denied because the person said you're trying to promote a scam and they refer reference this article as their source. And I understand it if we're talking about general consumers out there, or beginning entrepreneurs, but you would think that people that work and approve ads with major social media platforms would have some education on what to look for and what is constitutes a bait and switch article and this is regard this is obviously what this is it's extremely poor written extremely you can click on any of the other articles that they have and it's real obvious that this this post is nothing but throwing out negativity to do one thing, and that's promote these yield notes, which they would it's their affiliate for. That's that's right in the middle here. You can see it's promoting these yield nodes, which is part of a it's a crypto uh, business model. And and then all, given all this all this other information, but again, I'm not going to go through this. It's terribly written. Uh, it's obvious that this person is going to throw shade on any and everything that they can and their only purpose the bait is to get people to find in a search i hope global or any other fast moving growing company try to capture some of that traffic send them to a page create concern uh just throwing out stuff that is not true in many cases with the sole purpose of to promote these yield nodes. That's what's going on here, period. And this is just one of many sites, but we can go up here and just click on any of these. And I, and, and maybe some of these are a scam. I, I really don't know and, and not taking the time, and that's not the point. But here you go. Every Every post is a big promo. Click here to sign up with yield notes. That's that's the purpose of the article. It's not to provide any kind of value whatsoever, period. Bait and switch. That's what these blog posts do. A lot of times when I'm on podcasts or whatever, you hear me reference different third-party uh, sources, but I'm talking about Psychology Today articles, Success Magazine articles, uh, investors business daily articles and so on and so forth i'm trying to give credible sources and again we live in a world where what's credible and what's not credible you know when you're when we're talking about mainstream media and i will definitely give you that but to disapprove an ad or to throw up something in somebody's face that's not from a mainstream media source, but from some blog post whose obvious, obvious, again, you can click on any of these, whose obvious goal is to promote their own affiliate program makes absolutely no sense. So I hope you learned something. If you did, you know, you can hit the like button, but I just wanted to, to provide a little bit of information because I had somebody ask me, you know, a couple of days ago, because I said, it's just a bait and switch. And they said, well, Dale, what? I hear that all the time, but what is bait and switch? So maybe now uh, you have a clear understanding 
uh, as to what to look for and what it really means uh, when people say bait and switch. And this this website and many others out there are obviously bait and switch websites. And you see that a lot in the network marketing profession, internet marketers that are promoting how to set up your Shopify course or whatever. They'll give really good uh, reviews of a program. And then they'll say, but I wouldn't do MOM if you're really looking to make extra money from home. This Shopify course, blah, blah, blah. And it's a promotion for their specific program. So that's what's going on. Hope it helps you. Y'all have a great weekend. Talk to you soon.